Now we will begin Part A with the first conversation. Number one. You have rehearsal tonight? For what? I have a role in the school play. What does the woman mean? Number two. Would you like to get some coffee or tea, perhaps? I am a bit thirsty. What does the woman mean? Number three. You seem rather tired. Do you need to get some rest? I'm not at all tired. In fact, the opposite is true. What does the woman mean? Number four. The amount of money we had to pay for these texts was way out of line. I'll say. What does the man mean? Number five. You couldn't get into your apartment? Why not? The key they gave me wouldn't fit into the lock. What does the man mean? Number six. Did you go to the conference or did someone else represent you? I had one of my friends go in my place. What does the man mean? Number seven. What did the lawyer say? The lawyer told me to call him back tomorrow. What does the woman mean? Number eight. What can you tell me about Professor Mitchell's class? Well, there's hardly any homework, but the exams are really difficult. What does the man say about the class? Number nine. This math problem is just too hard. Let's leave it for now and come back to it later, after we've finished the rest of the problems. What does the man suggest? Number 10. Everyone was sure talking a lot in class. That's true. I had a lot I wanted to contribute to the discussion, but I couldn't get a word in. What does the man mean? Number 11. That meeting was extraordinarily chaotic, disorganized, and fruitless. It perturbs me that I had to sit through it in its entirety. Well, I'm glad I missed it. What does the man say about the meeting? Number 12. I can't believe how fast the professor spoke during the lecture on physiology. You can say that again. What does the man mean? Number 13. 
Can we get together this afternoon to discuss our project? Sorry, I can't. I have a doctor's appointment. I have to get my eyes checked. Where is the woman most likely going? Number 14. How would you like to go skiing this weekend? I was kind of scared the last time I tried it, but I'd like another chance to try it again. What does the woman mean? Number 15. The conference last weekend was really great. I heard that it was. I really wish I had been able to go. What does the man mean? Number 16. Do you think you should take a jacket to this baseball game? Oh, I wasn't uncomfortable at the last game, and I didn't have a jacket with me then. What does the woman imply? Number 17. You got a ticket? How did that happen? The car was parked in a no parking zone. What does the man mean? Number 18. Was Sally prepared for her presentation? I'm not sure she spent much time working on it. Trust me, she couldn't have been more prepared. What does the man say about Sally? Number 19. We've been invited to go sailing this weekend. Would you like to go? Sailing? I seldom have time to go sailing, and I really love it. Let's go. What does the man mean? Number 20. Sorry, I can't let you borrow my notes from yesterday's class because I don't have them. Then you weren't in class yesterday. What did the woman believe? Number 21. Didn't you hear the professor say that the paper must be at least five pages long? I must not have been listening during that part of class. What does the woman mean? Number 22. How long do we have to finish our projects for music class? They're due December 1st, aren't they? What does the man mean? Number 23. Can you believe that tuition has gone up for next year? I can believe it. The fee increase wasn't exactly unexpected. What does the woman mean? Number 24. Can you think of the answer to the last question? I need just a minute. It's on the tip of my tongue. What does the woman mean?
Number 25. So you have a part time job on the newspaper? Well, I do for now, but I've heard that some of the employees are getting laid off. I hope I still have a job after that. What does the woman say about the employees? Number 26. Have you seen your score on the exam yet? Yes, and I couldn't be happier with my score on the exam. What does the woman mean? Number 27. I heard that Professor Houston's economics class was really hard. Did you sign up for it? I really wish I hadn't. I heard that it was hard, too. What does the man mean? Number 28. You missed the committee meeting last evening. I would have been there if I hadn't fallen asleep when I got back from class. What does the man imply? Number 29. I'm going into the office on both Saturday and Sunday. So you will be working this weekend. What had the woman assumed? Number 30. Mary said some pretty unflattering things about our project. Yes, she did. We'll just have to brush it off and keep on trying to make the project better. What does the man mean? This is the end of part A.